Why, hello, YouTube modeling community. That's right. It's the fat man from Alabama coming to you from Don's Garage. That's right. It's me. We're here in the garage working on models. Well, this is a little bench update of sorts. Uh, spent a few hours earlier this Saturday night after 10 o'clock here. My bedtime. So, I'm going to do this quick video. <coughs> Show you what's been going on on the bench past, well, yesterday and today. Past couple of days. Anyhow, made a little bit of progress on the 34 Ford pickup. We've got the seat pleated, the tuck and roll. It ain't perfect, but the time I tape it up, paint it up, and everything, and stick it in that little bitty cab sitting there, it'll look fine. I've still got to make door panels and the headliner for it. Um, the spare tire, let's find something to hold this with. I got my little spare tire deal done. Well done. Yeah. It's got to have a little bit of more love, but it's looking pretty doggone snazzy. There it is. Got the pleats in it there. Pleats all the way around the band. And, let's see if I can get this to show. They line up, yep, and the other side. Not real sure which side's actually going to be the one facing the outside and which one because it's universal. I made a little pin on the bottom, and it locates into a small hole or divot, divot. and I put it in the bottom of the well, as you can see there. I will glue it in. Uh, let's see. Let's see if we can find a hole again. Like that. There it is. The spare tire is pleated. Tucked and rolled. Whatever you want to call it. Um, that's about all the progress. Well, there's one more piece. The camera's going to jiggle a little bit here in a second, fellas. Let me go get the bed cover. Ow! I told you it was going to shake a little. That's what happens when the fam, fat man walks on a wooden floor. There it is. Big cover's tuck and rolled. Got a little primer on it this afternoon. Looks pretty decent. I got a little scratch in it right there that I'll be fixing up here in a little bit. Um, I've got to address a couple of small issues underneath. I knew I would. Because uh, I'm going to slick the bottom. I got a big decal. It's going to go in here. So when the bed cover's lifted up or tilted, you can see it. Um, no more progress on the bed. Roll pan's the same as you seen earlier. I was concentrating on getting some of this other stuff kind of wrapped up. But there's the bed cover. Fits the bed nicely. So I got all that heading in the right direction. Uh, I got a few more small parts to work on with it, but other than that, uh, spent some time this evening also working on the stalled project, the little 53 Ford flip nose, the old MPC kit. Um, chassis, uh, I gotta come up with some air shocks. I did put some air cleaners on it. These are ones see we'll get this thing to focus here in a second fellas maybe it's got a wire mesh decal laid over it that decals from slicks with a good bit of solver set to melt it down and snugged up um, hmm, loose wheel uh, the chassis done other than putting the uh, coming up with a set of rear shocks I'll dig through the parts box I spent a little time this evening doing a little decal work on the bed. Um, you got a wood grain decal sheet from uh, Gopher. I ordered from Model Roundup. And I got it. I'm like, I'm digging this. Uh, and I still like it. Uh, it looks pretty decent. 
Unfortunately, I ignored fixing the injection pin marks. I got one there. I got one in each corner. Uh, got to live with them. I've still got to put a bed rail decal here and here. And then there's got to, I'll have to cut up a few pieces and do here, uh, do the four sides, bed sides. The unfortunate part, and this is where I'm not happy with this decal sheet. Now I bought this, I was hoping to do four beds. If it does, the next two, this, the dark wood, apparently is done for more of a long bed truck, which is what I used in this one. The light wood is for more of a short wheelbase truck, and it's going to barely fit a short bed. And they didn't give me enough bed rail decals. I've got one of the short rail decals left, and I've got to put two more in the bed of that truck plus the four side rails at the bedside. So I've got to cut into these here, which means I'm not going to have enough for here. The short wheelbase ones here, it took every, it took the entire length of each one. There's only six. One, two, three, four, five, yes, six. And I've got two, four, I got five on there now. You know, uh, not happy about that. I'm gonna get the decal work done on the truck, get it finished up, maybe tomorrow. Uh, now I've got to wet sand it. Well, I got to wet sand, I got to do some more, I'm gonna do some more decal work. I wanna do some pinstriping and a couple of little things. The other decal work we done is there it goes speedometer was going down going through the decal box and i found a decal for a i think it's a 69 70 nova it's an aftermarket decal actually it's off a rally sport sheet that had been done many years ago actually uh it was a little long so i made a tape template of the instrument hole and laid it over the decal and voila I have an instrument instrument panel in there without having to try to do a bunch of little detail painting which I don't have the hands for anymore also floated a little hodgepodge in there to give me a little bit of a lens look uh, the dash will get cleared when the body gets re-cleared then I'll do the final little details with my Molotov pen. That'll wrap up the interior. The steering column's done. I gotta look and see if I've got a steering wheel. I might have to dig through the parts box again because I don't see one in the bag. Not a problem. I got tail lights. We're good. Uh, a little love here and there, and that this truck will be done. Hopefully. The side pipes are already painted with a Molotov pen, have been for a couple of months now. So they're about they're ready to go. Uh, like I said, not a whole lot of big stuff done, but like I said, I got this stall project. I'd done a video on it a while, not that long ago. I put it in the lineup to get to for the month of October. I'm a little bit ahead of schedule so far, but it is not finished, so you never know what's gonna happen between now and the end of October. I uh, have not started on my Halloween group build yet. Uh, I got both kits sitting here right just to the right of me. So that's something that will be happening here in the next couple of days to get those projects started. The 34 Ford is going to be a filler between this other stuff. Um, there's a lot of little body work to do yet before I start putting a whole bunch of stuff in a primer. Uh, so... I still got to fit the hood and the radiator, uh, the grill shell, stuff like that. I'm in concentrating getting the back of the truck wrapped up, getting the tuck and roll pieces done. Uh, simply because that part's kind of new to me. I've done inserts before, but not this type. So, like I said, it's uh, new and old all at the same time. So, all right, fellas, that's it for the night. I am going to. Close the door, shut the lights off, close the doors, go in the house, grab some sleep. If it's your first time watching, like what you see, 
consider subscribing my channel hit the notification bell if you like what you see fellas drop a comment down below you know i like reading them and if you've got a shop if you're a content creator and got a shop card email me at this here email address put shop card in the subject banner send me your address i'll send you one i'll get, send you an email back with my address we can swap okay fellas that's it we're gonna close this one out remember to live love and laugh build the model any of these or whatever you got for you that's what i do i'm building these things to satisfy me yeah some of y'all seem to like them thank you i appreciate all of my subscribers new old and the ones in the middle without y'all this channel is nothing but me talking to space which is not a big issue i talk to myself often so y'all have a good evening have a blessed sunday Hit the ground and running on Monday morning. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye.